Hi everybody, welcome back to Good Reef. My name's Ross and this is my Waterbox Peninsula Mini 15 gallon. Okay, hi everybody, welcome back to Good Reef. My name's Ross and this right here is my Waterbox Peninsula Mini 15 gallon. This tank's been up and running for six months now, so I just wanted to do a little video here to show you guys how the tank's progressed, how it looks just now. So as you can see, I think the tank looks fantastic. Um, it's up to you guys what you think of it, but I'm really happy with it and how it looks. So like I said, we'll just do this quick video, run through everything, um, give you a quick overview, and you can see for yourself. So let's take a look. Look out, here she comes. But you'll never know Yeah, I can't tell her how I feel Because she has someone who makes her happy I'm a ghost in these walls Or at least I try to be Cause I hope that I'm not showing How I feel for her she won't feel the same for me I've got this picture in my mind It's just the two of us Just the two of us But I know I'll have to try Try to let her go Because she won't be mine I listen when she talks I watch her when she walks She's given me these feelings that I've never felt before But she will never know that I love her so well She's with somebody else and I will have to let her go She will never know, na na Never know, na na She will never know Like she stole my heart Without knowing she did But I guess that it will pass Yeah, I can't be the only one Who got lost inside the blue of those eyes I've gotta let her go I know it won't be easy I wanna hold her close Okay guys, so I hope you liked that first part of the video there. I just wanted to do something slightly different for this six month update to show you guys really where the tank's at, what it's like, um, just put a bit of music in to make things a bit different. So hopefully you liked that. Um, from that you'll see the very last clip there that the clowns are both looking healthy again. Everything's looking great with the clowns, everything's doing well, so really, really happy with that. Um, anyway, yeah, this is the six month update of the tanks. So the tank's been running for six months. Um, wasn't really sure how this was gonna go when I very first started out with the tank. If you look back at my previous videos, you'll see how I've gone through the stages. But this tank now hits six months, um, and I'm really happy with it. Wasn't quite sure how this was gonna turn out with the tank and the channel, actually, to be honest with you. Um, when I first started, I vowed to make a video every week and post a video every week, and I've done that since. So, fingers crossed I can keep going with that. Um, try and get a video out every single week for you guys. 
it helps me as well doing that, so something I can look back on. But yeah, that's the tank, it's six months. So, as you've seen from my previous videos, we've had ups and downs, highs and lows um, throughout this journey. But overall, I'm, I'm actually really pleased with it. A couple of things that are, I want to say to you guys is um, don't be put off by people telling you that this is an extremely hard hobby and you need all the fancy gear and everything. This is a super simple tank that I've got here. Literally all I have for filtration is filter floss, some biomedia, it's the Maxpec Biobulls that I've got, and some activated carbon, and that's it. I have the heater, I don't run a skimmer, I don't have any fancy control gear or anything like that, it's very, very simple. So if you are thinking about doing it, highly recommend doing it. You don't have to spend thousands upon thousands of no fancy electronic gear to get this to go. This is quite a simple tank and it works. So yeah, as you'll have seen in that clips there, um, a couple of issues I'm dealing with just now. Some hair algae on one of the front Zoa plugs here. Um, I'm going to take that out and give it a hydrogen peroxide dip, I believe. That's what I'm going to do. A um, couple of other small clumps of algae that I'm going to deal with, but nothing major to be honest. Um, like I say, the tank's starting to mature a bit now, six months, so really happy with it. Anyway, I'm going to try and keep this video relatively short, so I just wanted to show you the first kind of clips there. Clowns are all healthy, um, everything else looking good, touch wood. Um, what else do I want to cover? So I'd like to say thanks to a few people actually, just as our recent kind of helpers. So I don't know if you've watched the live streams that we do, um, but myself, Jay's Real Reef UK, Fish Palace and Moggs Aquarium um, teamed up together probably, oh, I don't know how many months ago, a couple of months back now and decided to do a live stream every Friday night. So it's 8 o'clock and we rotate it between our channels. So a massive thank you to Paul from Fish Palace, um, Steve from Moggs Aquarium and Jay from Jay's Real Reef UK. Three guys have helped me out massively. Um, any issues that I've got, they're my go-to guys, they really help me out. So totally appreciate everything from them. I'll link their channels in the description below. Um, a couple of people I want to mention, if you don't already follow them, please have a look. Uh, first one is Nanotank Reefer, Tris from Nanotank Reefer, fountain of knowledge, the guy's really, really good, his videos are fantastic. Absolutely love watching his videos, love his channel. If you haven't checked him out, check out his YouTube channel and his Instagram, I'll put that in the description below. And the final one is Ian Cosford. Now, Ian is, um, does have an Instagram page called Ian's Reef, I'll link it in the description below again. Ian Reef has pretty much been the inspiration for my tank as such. Um, his tank is absolutely stunning. He's recently moved to another tank, took all his corals with him. Um, predominantly Zoas, it's absolutely fantastic. So if you have got a chance, look at Ian's tank below. I'll link in the description. I do want to say thanks to Ian as well. Um, it was his photo that was on the cover of my last video about adding the Zoas. So huge thanks to Ian for that one. So yeah, not really much to talk about for the six month update. Um, I just wanted to show you the tank more than anything for that. There's no point in going through loads of different things, um, talking about all the stuff that's been in previous videos. You'll have seen the previous videos anyway, so you know that. If you haven't seen the previous videos, go and take a look at them and let me know what you think. Any questions, comments, issues, anything like that. Um, final mention is to my local fish shop, which is called Nessie's Lair. They're over in Dalgetty Bay in Fife um, and they've actually just turned one year old. So just wanted to give them a massive shout out. Their website will be going live tonight I believe. So I'll link that in the description. You can order corals and inverts to start with. Fish will be coming later, live, um, dry goods will be coming later as well. So yeah, thanks to Lessie's there for supporting me as well um, and all the help you gave me for this. So that's really it folks. I'm going to try and keep this short and sweet like I said. I want to show you the tank first, done that. Um, Nothing massive to report about. Next couple of videos will cover anything that I'm going to do, but yeah, let's tank at the six month mark. So, thanks so much for watching this video. Hopefully, it wasn't too boring a video for you, and I look forward to hearing from you guys soon. So, any questions, put them in the comments below. I'll get back to you. Um, if you haven't already, if you could subscribe to the channel, I know a lot of guys watch the video but aren't actually subscribed. So, if you could subscribe, it'd mean a lot to me. Um, that would I'd really appreciate it. It lets me know that you guys are enjoying the videos, still watching the videos, and so on. Um, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up as well and if you want to get in touch with me you can do so on Instagram, my Instagram channel is at bearded.reef So yeah, thanks to everybody for the support um, Six months in, let's look forward for another six months so fingers crossed things still go well and we'll get there in the end So hope everybody stays safe out there, take care folks, bye bye